show you another kakanin recipe called cassava balls. These are very easy. Locally, this is called inday inday. Let's get started. Here are the ingredients. One kilo grated cassava, two thirds cup sugar, one half cup of coconut cream. This is freshly grated coconut squeezed without water. Two tablespoon butter or margarine, red, green, and yellow food color. You put the cassava in a bowl. You don't need to squeeze out the cassava juice. Then we add in sugar. Coconut cream. The authentic Inday Inday does not have coconut cream, but I add coconut cream because it uh, improves the flavor. And then you have butter, or you can use margarine. This is butter. You mix this together. If you want it sweeter, you can increase the sugar. Instead of two-thirds, you can make it three-fourths. Alright, let's divide this into three. It doesn't have to be equal as long as we can make three colors. You'll add yellow to one. I'm using paste color, however, you can use liquid. You can use powder color. Just make sure you mix it very well. The Inday Inday has very bright colors. Okay, this is good. And then let's do the red next. So we have red, then we'll make the green. I use this for the green. These are the usual three colors of the Inday Inday. However, of course, you can make other colors you like. But this is like the uh, traditional colors, all right? So, next we're going to form them into balls. I have here a steamer. Okay. And then you just put, I put banana leaves. If you don't have banana leaves, aluminum foil will do or parchment paper. And then you put a little oil so that they don't stick. And then to make it easy, I use a, uh, an ice cream scoop and then I scoop them out right into small balls. This is about uh, one and a half inch. Alright. Let's do yellow. If you don't put coconut milk, you can roll it between your hands. But for me, I find the one without the coconut milk a little bit lacking in flavor. And also it's a little bit dry. And then we'll do the green next. You steam this about 30 minutes or until the cassava is cooked. You will know when the cassava is cooked because it becomes translucent. Right. 
by the way this is not going to expand so they're not going to like stick together all right so let's put this in the steamer the water is boiling now so let's put this in and then i put a towel so that the uh water will not drip into the cassava and then we time this about uh, 25 to 30 minutes or until the cassava is cooked i have many recipes to share with you if you're interested please like share subscribe and click the notification bell so you can be alerted when a new video is uploaded here this is ready this is cooked this a bit and then we roll this in freshly grated coconut when they sell this they usually score this like this but you will notice the one that they sell is round because they don't put coconut milk so the mixture is firmer so they can easily roll it okay so that's inday inday 